Most people don't consider their life insurance policies when tax season rolls around. Of course, life insurance's primary function is to help protect loved ones in the event of your passing, but life insurance in particular, permanent life insurance, can also help you and your beneficiaries manage the tax consequences of taking income from your investments. And joining me is Trent Miles with Tribute Wealth Management. He has offices in Farmington, Utah and Mission Viejo, California. Trent, let's start with the death benefit of life insurance. It's generally paid out tax-free, right? Yeah, thanks, Scott, for having me today. And yes, typically all life insurance policies, whether they're permanent or term, are always tax-free to the beneficiaries. So like a traditional IRA or a 401k, the cash value of the life insurance policy grows tax-deferred, doesn't it? Yeah, that's correct. It grows tax-deferred, very similar to how qualified plans work. Now, how can life insurance be used to create tax-efficient income? The beautiful thing about the way pulling income off of life insurance works is you do it in the form of a loan that you never pay back. Therefore, you don't pay income taxes on the income that's pulled out. So that's the first thing that it does. The second thing is if you have qualified plans like a 401k, uh, because the money comes out and it's not considered income, it actually lowers your overall income base, so you pay less taxes on the money coming out of the 401k as well. That's Trent Miles of Tribute Wealth Management in Farmington, Utah, and Mission Viejo, California. Thanks for watching Retirement News Online.